Hello friends, this is a crab apple tree and I want to show you where it grows its fruit. So this is a one year, one year old shoots right here. I don't know if you can see or not. So this is a tip. It has fruits. So it has a king flower. Right at the very tip, there's a king flower and there's five other flowers around it. So a total of six. If you can see one in the middle, it's called the king flower, it's like the biggest. And then there's five more. So there's a total of six potential crab apples. And then every single bud from here on has the same thing all the way until it reaches last year's growth. And then it doesn't have anything except these little spurs. These little spurs right here, they have a, a flower cluster on it as well. So spurs and, and last year's growth all has uh, fruit. So the idea uh, on these crab apples is to generate as much new growth as possible uh, if you're looking for fruiting and flowers. Anything older, as you can see here, is bare. There's nothing on it except if there's a spur. So spurs will have fruits, and you can see how, how little or how, uh, how less of them there is on the old growth. You'll see a one here, but then you go on to your last year's growth and you see all these flowers or potential fruit. So there's six flowers or six potential fruit on each bud right here. And that's the, and that's the same thing with all these uh, flowers right here. See, this is a shoot from last year, and every single one of them has flowers. And at the very tip, there's also flowers, and it's probably gonna be the first one to open right there. So, in the middle, there's one that's called the king flower, and then one, two, three, four, five more flowers around it. So, potentially, there's six apples right there. As you can see right here. All the new growth has flower buds right there. Nominal bud has uh, flower buds right there. So anywhere you look, flower buds, new growth, flower buds, flower buds, flower buds. Once again, nominal tip, flower buds. So everywhere here, All new growth, potential fruit. All new growth potentially has fruit. So this is a crab apple tree and that's how it fruits. So the idea is, you know, to cut, cut to either tip them uh, or cut branches back to generate new growth. Because if, if you don't cut it back, this is just going to grow out further away. And the fruit's going to be all out on the outsides. And there's, you're going to lose all your fruit from the middle of the tree. So from anywhere that you have new growth, you have fruits. From la whatever grew out last year is generating fruit. That's a crab apple. My name is John. I'll see you in my next video.